This is WWE superstar Curtis Axel, an alumni of Harley Race Wrestling Academy, and you're watching WLW TV. Wrestling fans, the World League Wrestling, welcome to the house that Harley Race built. I'm C.T. Harrison, along with my broadcast colleague, Art Scott. It's great to be here, C.T. Once again, we start off with a great match. Every week, we seem to just get better and better with these matches. This happens to be uh, part of the Young Lions tournament. That's right. Colton Theron Vaught, one of the youngsters we have from the Young Lions division, trained right here at the Harley Race Wrestling Academy in Troy, Missouri. And, and he is a young star in the making. I completely agree. I concur. There he is looking at that, looking at that big trophy. He wants that in the end, and you know it. Who doesn't want it? Remember, folks, you can find us on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even a YouTube channel. Just look for World League Wrestling. And if you haven't seen that YouTube channel, you're missing out. I agree. And Very determined young man right there. Hazelwood, Missouri, weighing 160 suede. Raheem De La <laughs> Again, another graduate of the Harley Race Wrestling Academy trained right here by the man himself. And you know, he's a very cocky, confident young man. He's trying to rise up. He's not, not been as good in the ring as he's wanted to be with victories. He's been very good, but not as successful as he would like to be. That's right. He's, 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 I'm telling you, his day's coming, though. He's looking for that perfect storm. He's looking for the right combination to get those wins that he needs. And this could be it. This could be it. If he could get past Colton Farron Pot in this tournament, Raheem De La Suede could go a long ways. It would certainly be a feather in his cap, CT. Wouldn't it? Be some fantastic bragging rights to say that you won the Young Lions Tournament at World League Wrestling. And you got to remember, both of these young lions took Leland Race himself to their very limit. Without a doubt. Your referee for this match, Elaney Harley, also trained right here at the Harley Race Wrestling Academy. I can't say too much about the Harley Race Wrestling Academy. Puts out great talent constantly. Without a doubt. If you want to learn how to wrestle, if you want to be a professional wrestler, the Harley Race Wrestling Academy is the only place you want to be. That's right. Get yourself a bus, a train. Come to Troy, Missouri. You can go anywhere in the world and learn to wrestle. But why wouldn't you want to learn how to wrestle? Harley Race. And the lockup. De La Suede quickly on the offense here. He's going to have to, he's going to, have to keep moving. There it is. CTV gives him one of his own. And the kip up. Back flip. Oh, very nicely done by Raheem De La Suede. And return the favor by must CTV Colton Farenbach. I don't think Raheem's too impressed. Well, he's only impressed by himself. <laughs> Single leg takedown. Very nicely done. Some great, great amateur wrestling right there. 
great mat wrestling skills. Oh, -ho! look at this. How about that? Up and yeah, over. Goes over. The arm. Big arm drag there, and followed up by another one from Raheem De La Slade. We'll be back, folks, with more great wrestling action in here at World League Wrestling. Professional wrestling returns to Troy, Missouri at the Race Wrestling Arena, February 22nd. This is where sports entertainment stops and professional wrestling lives. The house that Harley Race built. Doors open at 6 and bell time is at 7. The main event with the WLW Tag Team Championships on the line. Your champions Derek Stone and John Webb defend against two young lions, Colton Theron Vaught and Moses the Deliverer. You don't want to miss the wrestling action February 22nd at the Race Wrestling Arena in Troy, Missouri. Go to www.harleyrace.com for details. We are World League Wrestling. Do you want a unique way to raise money for your local community? Harley Race's World League Wrestling is here to help. There is absolutely nothing better than a professional wrestling event bringing the entire community together as one and showing support when it is needed the most. We have been sponsoring fundraising events for many years and we know that it can bring a lot of winning opportunities for your local charities, school organizations, non-for-profit groups, and whatever else may be in need of assistance. For more information, contact us. Don't wait. Go to www.harleyrace.com, email us, or call us to get information or to schedule a WLW professional wrestling fundraising event in your community right now. Welcome back, wrestling fans. This match underway. Raheem De La Suede versus Colton Theron Vaught. And to advance in the brackets of the Young Lions tournament here at World League Wrestling. In control right now, Raheem De La Suede. And he's stretching that back, stretching the back of Colton Theron Vaught. And you can see De La Suede, he don't usually take much seriously, but he's taking this match very seriously. He Absolutely. wants to advance in this tournament. I think he takes all his matches seriously. Up and over the rope. Nope, not quite to the floor. Of course, that doesn't matter in this match. This is not a rumble. Ooh, and a gut check there. Oh, Sway and a miss. Flying cross bodies from both of these gentlemen <laughs> at the same time meeting in midair, both of them down on the mat. That'll take a lot out of you. They have to, they have to get back up right here. Somebody needs to capitalize, CT. Indeed. Both of these young men, very different styles, but both of these young men, very exciting. Both crawling to the corners and edges, trying to get up on those ropes. Up and over, oh my goodness. It almost threw him out of the ring. It was face first into the, into the post, I think. Is he going for the three threats. amigos? There's the second Next one. Two. Will he get the third? Rolls him up. Up, it's blocked by Raheem De La Suede. Oh, look at that uppercut. Just staggered him. Get the two count. Great job by our referee. Would you look at that? That's Would a you great look at moon that? Salt. You'd think he could win the match with that. And Raheem De La Suede kicked out in the nick of time. Let's go, 
Ooh, clubbing blow to the back. Takes him to the corner. Raheem De La Suede's got to capitalize. This is where he's got to make it happen. Oh, meets, meets with an elbow in the face. He just took too long getting it. Destroyer CT, this is it. Oh, we got the two count. So close. There's oh, Colton saying this is his tournament. tournament. Wow, that's fantastic. This kid is so full of energy. And never give up, both of these kids. The hard it takes to get up there and do this. Oh! Jumped up with a knee to the face. Oh, he's mad. Five minutes left in the match. Five and it just left. dropped CTV straight to the mat. There's your receipt, Colton Therenvot, for that knee. You get one yourself. Now these kind of maneuvers can be very, very dangerous. There it is, a kick to the back of the head. He's just too high up. If he can hit this superplex, it's over, CT. De La Suede breaking it loose. He's he's getting ready to do it. In the top rope, there it is. Oh, that's the full Suede 450 splash. I think it's all over but the crying now. And there it is, your winner, Raheem De La Suede advancing the brackets minutes, of this seconds. Young Lions tournament. Your winner by pinfall, Raheem De La Suede. Let's get another Swain. look at this CT. Absolutely. Your replay brought to you by Jim Chinari, up and over, right to the spine of Colton Theron Vaught for the one, two, three. Fantastic showing by both of these young lions. Colton Theron Vaught has nothing to be ashamed of. The stars were just in alignment for Raheem De La Suede. And you know De La Suede really wants to win this tournament, but there's a Looks like might be a show of respect from De La Suede. Little bit, little bit. Here comes Moses. That can't sit well with De La Suede. You know, him and Moses have been through the ringer against each other. Moses getting in the ring. Oh, and a shove by Raheem De La Suede. Raheem likes his spotlight. He's got to feel like Moses is coming out here. And... Ooh, little shoulder bump there. Chest to chest, eye to eye. Raheem backing him up. I tell you what, folks. Great action right here at World League Wrestling. We'll be back with more right after this. Jim Trudary Ford in Moscow, Mills, Missouri has knowledgeable sales staff and expert service technicians dedicated to delivering the best possible customer service from any Ford dealership in the region. Subscribe to our channel for comprehensive vehicle walk-arounds, test drives, and model-specific how-to videos which will give you a glimpse into the passion we have for these vehicles and the real difference the Jim Trudary experience makes. Stay up to date on the newest technology, features, models, and news from Jim Trudary Ford where our huge inventory means we'll have the perfect vehicle to fit your lifestyle. Our seasoned team of sales and service experts can get you in, out, and on with your day without the pressure you'll feel at the other dealerships. Subscribe to our channel and stop by to see the difference the Jim Trenary experience can make today.
Welcome back, wrestling fans. This match is going to be a doozy. Moses has definitely got his work cut out for him here tonight. There you go, folks. Moses, the Deliverer. Trained right here at the Harley Race Wrestling Academy in Troy, Missouri. One of our young lions. He has certainly got a task set forth for him from a very extra unordinary opponent tonight. You know, with all, of, with all he's got going against him, against this guy, CT, I swear, these fans are with Moses 100%. And they're going to will him to victory if they can. That is very true. His opponent tonight is somewhat something out of a Edgar Allan Poe poem of some sort. He's just extra unordinary. That's right. He gets and for his and opponent tonight, we have too. and the more he Demarius gets in control, 2.0, the scarier he gets. Ominous. Ominous. And if you haven't been in the building for this, every one of these fans knows what's coming, CT. But you can. February 22nd at the Harley Race Wrestling Arena in Troy, Missouri. Our next live event. Where you can see wrestlers like Moses and Demarius Jones, 2.0. And this is the upgrade. Demarius Jones is in his past. Demarius Jones has been buried. This is the upgrade, 2.0. But if you look at him, look at him, Mark, he seems a lot more in control than, than he was in the past. He's, it's like maybe. Maybe finally the upgrade is complete. He doesn't seem to be in conflict with Demarius anymore. He seems like he's stalking Moses, just pacing outside the ring there. Uh, there it is, folks. The upgrade to a point. Oh, a former junior, junior heavyweight, heavyweight champion. champion. Lost his belt recently. Lost the strap to Sean Patrick. Again, a graduate of the Harley Race Wrestling Academy. I can't say that enough. And another young lion. He lost his belt, he says. Your referee, Martin Kadich, trying to check him out. Demer He's almost a like minute. a man possessed. He's Is he? I... Maybe the upgrade isn't complete. He seems to be coming apart at the seams just a little bit, like like there's a few flaws, just a few cracks yet to be sealed to keep Demarius in and 2.0 out. I'll tell you, he's a, he's a hard wrestler to prepare for when he's like this, though. You don't know what to expect. All you know to expect is something out of the ordinary. That's the only thing you can expect. At times, he's... He's charismatic. He's, he's. Look out, kid. Uh, you don't want the. Uh, oh, Demarius. Or should I say upgrade? Because that is not what Demarius would do. No, it's not. Your referee, Martin Kadich, calling for the bell. This match is underway. Moses trying to get these fans fired up and behind him. He is successful in that. Demarius stalking his prey. And the lockup. 
Do you think Moses is a little this, off his game with this? It's, I, I don't know that he just doesn't know what to expect, but how do you even try to, to imagine what to expect when your opponent is like this, like 2.0? It just... It would be hard to not get inside your own head with someone acting as as outlandish as he does. He's how could you? And, and it looks like he's fighting Demarius back. That's just strange and odd. It's the distraction Moses needed, though. And here he goes firing with the drop kicks. Headlock, Headlock. takeover. Moses is going to try and wear him down a little bit. Demarius Jones trying to work his way back up to his feet. I, I think he just yelled, you can't hurt me, CT. Well, I tell you, we'll be back with more this match when we come back here at World League Wrestling. This is Harley Race. Make sure you're watching every Saturday night at 6 p.m. Wrestling fans, this match continues between Moses the Deliverer and the Upgrade 2.0. I want to remind you to join us next week here at World League Wrestling for a rematch between Brandon Espinoza and Austin Cravens. Also, Sean Patrick, your junior heavyweight champion, will be in action against the former heavyweight champion, John Webb. What a great show, but just now, Demarius Jones seemed to pick something off the mat and put it into his tights. What was it? Putting it away. I couldn't tell, CT. I couldn't tell. Moses trying to, trying to get on top of Demarius Jones here with a big body slam. Going oh, straight. For the one, two. Gets the two count. 2.0 kind of slapping himself awake after that big body slam. That was just a closed fist punch to the face. It was not a wrestling move at all. No. And he's pulling the hair and another punch to the head. He's just disregarding the rules here. Referee Martin Kate is trying to get him to stop. That might have been a mistake. Might have been. Oh, sniffing it. Is it's that a piece of the dreadlock from, from Moses. He's smelling it. Oh, he's going to keep that for later. That's uh, rather odd and strange. It's you almost know weird. What, do. what the heck would he want to keep that for? I don't know. He got 
He got told about getting into hair and he produced Moses' hair himself. Yes, he did. Oh! Big spinning kick to the chest of Moses. If he would if he would just capitalize right here, I think it could be it. But Absolutely. He, there he goes. He's arguing with himself in the corner again. And just a reminder, you can see all these matches in their entirety. Oh! Was he going for a curb stomp? What was he? I think he was trying to finish him off right there. You can see all these matches in their entirety by just going to WorldLeagueWrestlingTV.com and joining for $4.99 a month. Also, get all your t-shirts. Upcoming events. Oh, with the back elbow. HarleyRace.com. www.HarleyRace.com. Stanley. Wow. In Seguri. And he can capitalize right here. He's getting ready to go in. And the oh. big clothesline. There's his bulldog. There it is, folks. Going for the one, two. No. Denied once again. Only getting the two count. Demarius Jones by himself is a hard man to put away, but he seems to take just massive amounts of punishment and come right back now that he's started this upgrade, CT. Area. Oh, his feet taken out from underneath him. Oh, that is blatant right in front of the referee. Uh-oh. He's letting me know. Look at that move by Moses, though, with the shiver. Well, let's look at your replay. Brought to you by Jim Trenary. That just shows you the talent level of our wrestlers. Oh, without here at a World doubt. League there Wrestling. it is. Wow. At any moment. Just slams him right to the mat. What's he going to do? those shoulders. Oh, it's rolls Moses. out of it. And Moses rolls, rolls him up. up. One, two. Oh, oh he got three. He that got it. Three. One, two, three. Moses the deliverer. That is the wrestling you will see right here at Harley Race's World League Wrestling. I what agree. A fantastic though. match. Moses what a, needs to go. What a great show, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us. Right here at World League Wrestling. We'll see you next week. We are World League Wrestling.